Uh, well, well, it certainly looked like you had a hungry defense that hadn't played in three weeks. Uh, you had the, the five turnovers, six sacks, and I think you had 10 three and outs. How pleased are you with their performance today? Yeah, that was one of uh, our better performances probably in the last couple of years. Um, all things considered, you know, uh, an experienced team like Pitt, both sides of the ball, and, and uh, Kenny Pickett's playing really, really well uh, this year. Um, man, we had a bunch of uh, – uh, we had a few guys starting their first game and um, really most excited about establishing the line scrimmage, uh, disrupting the flow of their offense, creating the turnovers. And, um, just got into a great rhythm uh, early. Comes again, our, our preparations just been outstanding. A lot of guys that are hungry. It's a great, you know, adjective to use to describe this group of guys. Um, got a great self-awareness and a lot of humility, good leadership. Uh, so proud of the guys. A lot of guys banged up, uh, fighting like heck to get back uh, on the field. And, and um, again, guys like Ray um, or Malcolm, and Mario, all starting their first college game tonight and uh, coming up big, you know, playing really well. So uh, complete, you know, performance. They were dominant. And, um, you know, it, other than maybe that drive there and start the second half, you know, really just outstanding football and, and got a chance to play 94 guys and uh, and um, really getting, getting to a great rhythm here going down the stretch run. And we talked about, I know I, we talked about last time we met um, uh, with y'all in the media, just you saw some incremental improvement uh, that you hope to make um, both during our off week. And again, just as the season goes on and the best teams and the best units, the best players, that's what they do. They, they find a way just to keep getting better. And that comes from the work, the commitment, um, you know, self-awareness, humility, um, selflessness, guys letting you coach them, and, um, and then guys, again, putting their, he their, their heads down and going to work. And um, so, again, just, you know, that's the kind of, again, a performance that you want to see coming off, you know, three weeks not playing and, again, getting, getting a chance to, to go down this stretch run. And, uh, and still there's, there's plenty of things to get better at, you know, fundamentally and scheme and still working more guys back in. Uh, you know, so we had some guys that didn't play tonight, some guys that were out, and um, you know, get them back and, and, and uh, just create more depth and more opportunity for more guys. Coach, speaking of those guys that were out, um, it, it had to, to concern some uh, seeing that, that Landon Zanders and, and backup safety Jalen Phillips were both going to be out today, especially with a quarterback like Pickett slinging around. Uh, but you had to be pleased with the way that uh, that Thornton and Charleston played at safety. Yeah, those guys, they played well. Um, they played real well. Um, Tyler got in uh, as well with our 3-4 with our, uh, uh, defense as well. And all three of those guys played really well. Uh, made, made the right plays, made the layups, and uh, helped us get into a flow. And uh, really proud of all those guys. Um, really stepped up, Sheridan, DK. Uh, weren't able to play and, and uh, again Mario and and um, and uh, <laughs> Mario and the Anthony and um, uh, Andrew and um, who else we got who's my fourth guy there I think we had four of them um, Fred they all uh, got a chance to get in there and and, uh, and play really really well Malcolm Green too well hey, Malcolm and Malcolm played extensively at uh, in our nickel spot uh, tonight. And he played really well, made again his first start and, and uh, just was, was terrific. Um, and that was, a, that was a tough one because we were short at corner and uh, that's the only reason why we hadn't played him more in there. We've just been, it's been like this all year uh, at corner and uh, just having, you know, a healthy group of guys and we want to be able to use, take advantage of, you know, Malcolm's skill set and, um, you know, so we went in knowing that if we lose one corner, we're going to have to probably pull him uh, from that nickel spot and put him back at corner. So, uh, fortunately, we were able to uh, stay healthy there at corner tonight. Just a quick announcement. Coach Sweeney has started in room three. Continual questions. What? Coach Sweeney's getting started in room three. Okay, I got you. With questions. Sorry, you're good. Any good. other questions for Coach Venables? How good was it to have uh, Tyler Davis back in tonight in the middle uh, to help with the run and also to have uh, Skalski get significant reps tonight as well? <laughs> yeah, it was great. 
I mean, first of all, they got, you know, experience and leadership. Um, both got a physical presence to them. And, uh, and again, Jamie's, again, he's been our quarterback, you know, uh, the last two years. So, again, that, that's, that's uh, you know, you can't just put the next guy in, expect him to be the same kind of leader right now, you know. Um, so that's not where we're at from a, a you know, a maturity standpoint. So uh, that was big. And again, um, a little bit limited from uh, a durability standpoint, but they, they came in and played really, really well uh, tonight, both of them. But, uh, you know, defense, you're going to be defined by how, how well you play up the middle. And, uh, and, you know, these are guys that are, again, consistent players that, you know, play at a high level and there's a level of anticipation. And, um, you know, there's a, you know, the experience in regards to leading and, um, just a lot of little things from, from, you know, Jamie's like having a coach out on the field and, uh, and Jake's done very well, you know, uh, since he's been out, uh, Jamie's been out, but, uh, you know, Jamie's again, he's a, he's a fifth year senior. He's played a lot of football and, uh, he's just, you know, on another planet right now, uh, compared to a lot of players when it comes to, uh, you know, his knowledge and experience and again, his level of anticipation and, and how fast he plays as a result. When did you find out that you were going to get those two guys back for this week's game? Uh, going probably on Monday night, uh, maybe more Tuesday. Just because of the Monday was like, ah. I think Tyler actually didn't take his first uh, live rep stuff till maybe Wednesday. So, um, and then Jamie, you know, he's he's probably a couple of weeks early, uh, but this guy just absolutely loves to play, and uh, you weren't going to keep him off the field. So. Um, very thankful for um, his toughness and, again, uh, his selflessness, uh, you know, and just and his, his uh, love for his teammates, love for Clemson, and opportunity to, you know, to play out here again on senior night. And it meant, meant a lot to him, put a lot of work to, to get back out here.